Eagle Stadium, where this evening it's the Sharon Eagles taking on the Oliver Ames Tigers. And hello again, everybody, right here from the press box. I'm Nick Weeder. I've just locked that window. Did not mean to do that. Cannot for the life of me figure out how to get that open. There we go. That was much too difficult. Anyway, the Eagles looking for a good start to the week here against Oliver Ames in their next to last game of the season. At away, it was a 5-0 loss at Moscato Stadium in Easton. But tonight, the Eagles look to change that with a draw over the weekend. A somewhat memorable game for some of the wrong reasons. For me and Ryan, at least, we had to stop that broadcast after 27 minutes due to rain and things possibly getting broken. We're ready, get set, let's go from the stadium in this final week of the regular season for the Hockamock League. It's looking like Alex Budavalsev in. It's James Jennings. Got it ahead for John Sevy, who scored the lone Eagles goal in the 1-1 draw against uh, Walpole, the Walpole Timberwolves on Saturday. Now just ringing it around. Diego Rivera got down ahead, and it's Elon Yampolsky getting in the way. Now Diego Martinez, who went down after a very bad challenge on Saturday, wearing a knee brace. Alex got in the way. He's headed a long touchback. Now a shot possibility is that one just goes straight up and through the uprights. Is Sam O'Reilly tested for the first time. If you'd call that a test, it is what it is. But the goal kick coming courtesy of Max Sheng, who got it out. It's rocketed right back. Alex got ahead on it. And now Vlad Skolnikov looking for Elon. Got it ahead. It's deflected along, goes out. An eagle throw along the far side. The eagle sitting at 1 11 and 4 this season. But things can change here in the last week, and the Eagles might be able to build up a little winning streak to end the season. Oliver Ames, the best team in the Hawk, at 12 2 and 1. So this should be a really, really Good matchup. The Eagles trying to prove something before the season ends, and oh wait, just trying to finish off a truly excellent season strong. As that one's out for an eagle throw taken by Alex. Theoretically, yeah, oh, there you go. Got it. In. Eventually, yes. We'll go all the way back on net to. Senior captain Drew Hall, and picked off by Diego around center. Now up ahead for James. James darting ahead, couldn't keep the ball, almost ran himself into the net. But an early attempt for the Eagles. Just moving it around the back, it's Diego Rivera. Sent down ahead, hit Elon in the leg. A good cut to the inside by Leo Yin along that near sideline we have. And they'll go back on Drew Hall. Got it ahead, headed along. It's Braden Blass. Battling, they win it. Tapped along, that was Nish Prasad that fell. Going back to wearing his original number 11. After wearing number 15 on Saturday, which confused everything out of me. Now a break here for OA. Trying to cross it, that's a great tackle. 
And it stayed in bounds, and the Eagles get it back. Here's Elon darting through a pair of defenders. Found James looking for Diego. Couldn't get it to him. Up ahead, here's a shot just wide. Is that shot coming courtesy of Joey Carney? Not troubling Sam, who has been quite the effective backstop for the Eagles this season. Just a lot of injuries have berated them and really not helped them out. He'll shouting for a handball, and it's given. There's John Sevy going around trying to get the ball. Well, the Eagles in OA, always a good matchup, no matter what sport it's in. Max goes short for Alex. And that was definitely a handball. Coming up, clipping the arm. And it's Alon looking like to take the free kick as Alex abdicates. Guys swarming around the top of the box as that's crossed in, looking for maybe John. Leo tried to get it quickly for a niche, couldn't do it. Now it tapped way up in the air. Here's Joey Carney. We'll just back up. Carney goes across. Nikki Babanikos goes back. And Drew Hall. Now tapped ahead. It stays in bounds, knocked out by Anish. So that's Oatman uh, Chadley going for it. Now it's clipped up high. Still in, now tap forward. The rush is on. It's Carney he tapped it out himself, it looked like. And a goal kick it is. Or a corner kick. Goal kick? Corner? We're very confused. It's a goal kick. Nope, it's a corner. All right, well, that wasn't confusing. Side note, it really, really was. So the corner coming. Here for OAs. The service comes up at the top of the box. And that's a penalty. And I don't know what was going through Alex Budovalsev's mind there. I don't know if he was going for like the the hand of God type Maradona play or what, but that has to be one of the weirdest penalty kicks I think I've ever seen in my life. I have no words for that. No idea what he was even thinking. But now Sam pressured nice and early. Just eight minutes in, and this is pretty much gifting OA the perfect opportunity to take the lead. And he scores. I don't know what the thought process was. But in the end, it's... What was that? That was... Ryan Luhairs, who put it in, and a bizarre start to this one. Well, what an odd way to start this one. So now the Eagles playing from behind. I, I, I can't say I've ever seen that before. Over the top for John. John touches, tuck, tuck, words, touches it ahead, went in for it, got all ball, took his man down, but in the end it's right on Drew Hall. Forgot to click update. Eh, it's not working. What? There you go. I apologize for the... Uh, Graphics issues. Hall punts that one out. And that one just 
shoved out of bounds by Braden Blass. And he sh will let Leo take the throw. Yeah, Alex Budavolsev. I, I don't even know what was going on there. Sounds headed back. It's Diego Rivera. Let it go. So one nil Tigers. And Hall punts it. Vlad trying to get in the way. Elon tapped it out himself. That cross was blocked by Max. Now flicked along. It's onside. And a great point blank save by Sam O'Reilly. Got it easily in stealing one from Jackson Mieri. And it's a corner on the other side. Good job there by Sam. Not really his fault. That cross came right in onto the goal line. Maxwell just play it out. I think he was trying to go off the outside of his foot and couldn't do that. He looked a little frustrated with himself. Since Diego Rivera goes back to Drew Hall. Trying to give Hall the Hawk lead in touches, apparently. We'll do it again. Well, it's like a uh, another defender back there when you need him. Well, he is the ultimate defender in the game of soccer. Sounds played ahead right on Hall. He's the guy who, without defenders, would be pretty much helpless. So... Hall lets it fly. Elon trying to get in the way. And that one's tapped ahead. That's Luke Meixel who heads it along. He's this year's Reese Davis. It's a very interesting way to describe him, but I was having that conversation with Jeff Connors back on senior night about those defenders who have played the entire season and Thinking about him and Max, that have just been, have been pretty good back there. Looking for a handball call. Vlad tried to reach in and couldn't get it. On the near side, that one's touched along. Anish got in the way. One in the nutmeg, his defender. And Vlad got it to James, tapped it ahead. John went right back to him, but there's no one there. And a couple of subs coming in for away at the next chance. Now oh, Vlad. Diego has a niche flying ahead, won't use him. Instead goes to Leo. Leo through three defenders. Now busting through. And that's blocked. Sent to the far side. Just along and Luke completely mishit it. And the subs will not come in. Oh wait, trying to play hurry up. That shot just barely snuck over the net. And now the subs will come in. A quick thank you here at the start of the game to all of our crew. We've got three cameras going. Very cool, all these cool shots coming to you on the last week of the season. Just trying to give you everything you need to remember this season by. If not the team, then remember the broadcast. I don't know. It's Oatman Chadley going for it. Yeah. 
So we got three cameras going. We got Director Isaac Garofsky in the room next to me, who's running the entire setup, and then I'm on graphics. So if they look terrible, that's why. Well, Diego slipped on the ball. And wins it back, unfazed. Now got that one ahead, James, flying through. It's an eagle throw. John, try to rainbow move. And now it eventually goes out. For a Drew Hall goal kick. Hall going short. It's Diego Rivera. And that one tapped ahead. That one cut across. Luke got in the way and cleared it out. So it's like. Josh Ventura. Well, the near side official not happy with that throw in, giving it to the Eagles. So the Eagles ending up with the ball. We'll get it across Diego. Tapped ahead, Leo flying back. Gets it to Anish, tried to cut it up the inside. Now I want to out off him. And quickly, and cut across and sent way wide by Joey Carney, it looked like. And the Eagles will make a pair of subs. John and Anish out. It's like Owen and Zach Bernstein in. And Zach Bernstein, he's one of those guys where you want him to be there on corners. He is a towering presence. Definitely one of the tallest guys on the field. Now a giveaway from Max. Here's Carney cutting across. Blocked by Budovalsev. Now... Elon to James, a sub waiting to come in for Oliver Ames. No, Zach Bernstein couldn't get it into the middle. It's chipped ahead. Got past Elon and now a counter. Numbers forward for the Tigers. Now it's tapped across. Thinking maybe a shot possibility. And they'll just bring it back. And it's looking like coming in for Oliver Ames. It's Daryl Walsh. If that is a 34, I see. Pretty sure it is. Now it skitters across. Vlad intercepts. Here's Leo. Vlad. Knocked that one ahead. Off a head. Off a second head. Zach Bernstein's head. Now Diego has Leo. Leo back for Diego Martinez. Alex turned it over. The second sub waiting to come in for OA. Leo got in the way, turned it over. Leo got in the way, picked it off. Zach Bernstein has to get rid of it. Finds Owen Sobe. Fresh into the game. Diego tried to chip it ahead. Owen getting on his horse. And now one is played out. 
So, away unable to make their subs. Leo, trying to cut ahead, cut back past a few defenders. Goes to Luke. Now Elon. His Eagles push numbers forward there for a second. Now trying to get them back. Here's Vlad, good ball. James on side, gets in, stops Zach Bernstein, oh! Oh, the gaping cage. And Zach Bernstein over caffeinated airmails it. Oh my. Oh. oh. Dropped my walkie. It's fine, it's Ryan's, I think. Wow. <laughs> A yawning net and. Well, for those of you that play FIFA, or I guess now EAFC, he was trying to. Go for a circle shot and got L1 circle, which is chip shot. Just held the button for too long. Yes, it's PlayStation, not Xbox. I get it. Yeah, here the... Let me get the uh, the Xbox. Well, the uh, PlayStation slander will come in. I get it. Eagles now going quickly. That missed opportunity from Zach Bernstein. Now clobbered ahead. Will it stay in bounds? It won't. It's Joey Carney attacking it. Oop. Past the 20 minute mark. Diego, couldn't cut it by, a few went down even, nothing. I don't judge the calls, it's because I don't make the calls. I just tell you about the calls. Now Elon, Diego to Vlad, back to Diego, up ahead James is on side and got by a defender. Now trying to cut it inside and out and inside and maybe back out again. Owen, James offside this time. Oh, he was treading on thin ice there with the offside having been potentially offside at least two or three times before that. And Drew Hall, who will take the offside from the far side. Aha, uh -huh, see what I did there? Yeah? No? Okay. <laughs> well, at least I can make myself laugh. I got that one out. Vlad lunging in. And that play is onside and blocked. It's still there. They score. That was a beauty shot right to the top corner. And an utterly fantastic goal by Josh Ventura. It's 2 0 away, and that coming on the heels of a big missed opportunity for the Eagles. The Tigers ahead by two as they double their advantage. Here around 17 minutes before halftime. And the sub made is it's, it's like Cyrus Hanjami out. But. Really nothing the Eagles could have done there. That was just great movement. And a perfectly placed shot. And it's Josh Ventura who Puts the lead to two. Now the Eagles trying to cut it back to something reasonable. I'm not saying that two and isn't reasonable. It's just. Well, if it were me, it wouldn't be reasonable. 
Diego chipped it. Owens on side and fired it over the net. Oh, my. Oh, the Eagles are going to have to shoot it down next time. But really, just another missed opportunity there for Sharon. Is Daryl Walsh off? Drew Hall on the goal kick. Zach Bernstein to Diego. Flying forward through everyone like buttered corn on Thanksgiving. Is that going to stay in? It will. Zach Bernstein got in the way. Leo will let it go out. Leo getting the throw right in front of the camera. Nice. And that is out. It's an eagle throw. Much to Craig Churchill's dismay down there. Here's Alon. Back for Max. Max couldn't get it to, it's Peter Lerner in with Alex out. That was good timing. <laughs> Just talking about him then cut to him. I did not mean that, by the way. Now it's sent back. Luke on the header. Alon to Vlad. Cuts it back. Peter looking ahead for Owen. No one knocked out by James. Around 15 minutes to play. In this first half, as a sub will be eventually made. Yeah. Ooh, nice step over. And another chance for a break. They tried to get the cross in, couldn't do it. Let's cut to the inside. There's a chance. Leo trying to knock it out. And a foul whistled. Braden blasts the guilty party. A 2 0 OA lead. And now the officials critiquing the uh, placement of the kick. They'll let the kick go eventually. Here's Vlad. Drops it back. Peter over the middle. Now Zach Bernstein. Settled down and chipped over the top. Over, over Zach Bernstein. That's a hard thing to do. He's very tall. It's back on Drew Hall. Easily picked off by Diego. Has Vlad to the middle. He goes to him. And a nice one, too. Diego cut it to the inside. Here's James. Got off a shot. Went down... Wasn't a penalty. And now here comes the breakout. There's counter possibilities stopped by Peter. Foul whistled. And some pushing and shovings. Alon getting a little frustrated. It's understandable. Eagles bench, all smiles. Looked like too many smiles. There's a niche and uh, a couple other guys down there. Now it fed into the middle, blocked by Luke. Alon there now blasted ahead for Owen. They'll let it go. It gets into the penalty box. A 
and easy for Drew Hall. She's wearing the uh, the bandana. It's a maybe it's a headband. I assume it's a headband. But uh, yeah, I feel like quite a few goalies nowadays, especially with hair like that, keep it uh, up. As Koya Wilcox in here for for a lawn. Koya seeing immediate action. Peter goes to James. Couldn't get the head. Here's James. Tapped it forward maybe for Zach Bernstein. And cleared ahead. Luke with a crazy vertical. Peter under pressure. Kept in by James. And then Peter got it out over the middle. Oh, and off a couple of arms, maybe shoulders. Bet it to the near side. It was behind the OA player, and Leo picks it off. A nice step over, intercepted. And the pass looking for Koya. Now here come the Tigers again. Joey Carney tried to cut it to the outside, slipped, and then Leo just plays it out through his legs. And an OA sub. A pair of them, actually. Long, long, long throw coming in. Took a bounce. And Leo got it out. Not much. Into the middle. He's a shot on the ground. They score. And that was another beautiful shot. It was through traffic. And it's three for Oliver Ames. It's Ryan Linhares. I believe his second. And the floodgates have opened here for the Tigers. 3-0. Sounds over the top for Zach Bernstein. It's onside and he's chased into the corner. Now Zach plays it. It's still in. Zach wins it. Oh, they called that a foul. So and scored, but doesn't matter. Looks like a yellow card was issued. Owen might have received a yellow there. Or I guess not. Well, it was Zach Bernstein who got the yellow. A niche in. Huh. I mean, that didn't even look like a foul to me. That's just me. I don't know. I thought that was a clean challenge. But I guess not, and it's even a yellow to add that, I guess. No one's out. Zach Bernstein unable to come in, and I guess, I guess he is able to come in, just Coach Nathan not wanting him to come in, seeing how Anish will do. You know, Diego coughed up the ball. Now here come away again. Fed across, picked off by Luke. Oh, Diego got hit in the face. It's been a rough week for Diego Martinez. It's 
Max on the on the kick here. And a tap to head, and here they come again. Fed forward looking for Joey Carney. Took down Peter. Played out. Here with seven and change to play. It's Oatman Chadley on the throw. Tapped out. Eagle throw. Foul whistled on Owen, it looked like. And a, uh, a snap, I guess. It's so the other football. She'll be played between these two teams on Thanksgiving at Moscato Stadium. It's the uh, annual... Eagles Tigers Thanksgiving game. Now tapped ahead. On side. Cut to the inside. Fired back post. Went past Sam and out. Josh Ventura back in, one of the goal scorers. Thud. Something fell. There you go. Kick comes out. Played over the top. Owen got in the way. I said to cross, almost right at Diego, but it hopped up over his foot. And knocked a head off of Luke, who turns it over. Cut to the inside. Now tapped across. Here's Joey Carney. Put it to the outside. Back to Carney. Picked off. Luke to Diego. Lots of room for him to run. Lost control of it. It's just been a bit of a rough first half for the Eagles. They're down three. We go back on Drew Hall. And, I mean, the Eagles have had quite a few chances here in this half. They had one that probably would have tied the game. They're from uh, Zach Bernstein much earlier in the half. Oh, that one completely missed. James fired it over the net. Again. Trying to go high short side on Drew Hall. Couldn't do it. And that's been this Eagles half. Chances but cannot finish. It's a little unfortunate. Vlad, Diego didn't get it, Koya did. Now sent into space for James, but it goes back to Drew Hall, who's just gonna play it out. So Peter on the throw. As Koya didn't go to him, went instead towards James. Now Peter goes back to James. Here's James Jennings, the recipient of quite a few chances here in this half as we approach three minutes to play. Koya. Leo. Oodles of space. I 
Don't think I've used that word this year. Oodles. I think I've used poodles. Leo is going to end up winning it. Now Leo. Cutting it in. Crossed it. Blocked. Out off him. And it's a goal kick. Well, it looks like Leo either didn't agree with the call or just was frustrated at himself. Both are distinctly possible here. And I didn't say that they were mutually exclusive. So we hit two minutes, clock stops. Five minutes is when the clock stops for the first, uh, second half. I don't know, some half. Pick a half. Pick your favorite half. Now it's tapped ahead on the side. Well, it feels like teams have done a good job at staying on the side. It feels I believe there's only been excuse me. There's only been the one off side here in this half. Now it's cut across and a shot hit Luke in the back of the head. Now a chance. Easy. That was Bernie Ellie on the chance there for Owen fell. Oh, good play by Peter. Keep the ball in the air. Koya. Anish. Wow, that's an eagle throw. Okay. And Derek Walsh. Disagreed. Peter. Koya. Diego with it. Couldn't cut it past defenders. We'll go back on Drew Hall. Un minuto mas here in this first half. Now tap forward. Oh, a niche. Veered off at the last second. Didn't go for it. Obviously, he wouldn't want a collision with the goalie. Referees always side with the goalie. That's why I was a goalie when I played. Which Diego just too heavy on the pass there. Off Leo's foot turned over. Carney. Goes back. Jackson Mieri got it ahead. Vlad touches it back for Max. Maybe one last chance for the Eagles or the Tigers, whoever, whomever. Don't want to get yelled at for incorrect grammar. I hate when that happens. Well, they go quickly. Here's Ryan Lynn Harris right at Sam is that half. Maybe not. And that's half. Officially. So, a bizarre PK around 10 minutes in. And a couple of good shots after that. It's halftime from the stadium. Your score, it's the uh, OA Tigers three, the Sharon Eagles nil. We'll be back in about 10 minutes. For those of you who are alive, for the second half, and for those of you who are watching later, we'll be back in a flash. Welcome back, half numero two from the stadium. Found it interesting that OA was literally out on the field five minutes. Around five minutes ago, yeah. Thought that was bizarre. But the half will start. I'm planning on going outside for the second half as long as the mic doesn't take hair out of my skull. Back underway. All right. Just completely missed on the graphic. But, you know, it is what it is. So, 
Vlad with it. Pokes it back. It's Alex Budovalsev. Who's back in to start the second half. Here's Elon. Looking ahead. Now James Jennings. Tried to get off the cross. Up top, it's Vlad. Touches it along. Now out to the far side. And picked off. There we go. Quite a good amount of slack here. Here's Vlad. Elon floats it. Leo. Couldn't get off the cross. And it's out an eagle throw. So it's deflected. Oh, wait, trying to counter here. Can't quite do it. So they go back, Elon chests it. Trying to win it, can't do it. Joey Carney tapped it ahead, break on away. Tapped forward, and Leo got thrown to the ground. And a free kick. Now on the shot back. Here's Max up against a, no, really off of an OA defender or attacker. Oh. <laughs> now nearly took off the referee's head as it goes out. Row for OA comes in. Tapped way up in the air. Luke getting max elevation. And offside is whistled. And this comes after a first half where I was saying how OA was doing such a good job staying on side. Now here they are in the first five minutes getting whistled. I feel like there was something there. Now trying to get off a cross. Shot. Fire just wide. Holy cow. Sam going to uh, full length and then some. Full Superman. Max goes short. Alex got it ahead. Owen darting back. Elon dashing into the way, trying to pick it off. Can't do it. And tap forward the pass. Missed. And And picked off by OA, sent into the middle. Luke's there, can't get it that far out. Here's Carney. Joey Carney got it to the near side. And Carney couldn't get it forward. Hit a lawn, got it to James. Nice little one two there with a lawn. Hit a OA player in the face. Now 
up ahead. Here comes Owen. Oh, we'll send that one back. Over the middle, Vlad picks it up in stride. Ahead for Zach Bernstein, who's onside and off to the races. Zach was pressured. Was forced to take the shot and it went just wide. It's a goal kick, just a little unfortunate there from Zach Bernstein. Oh, and since a head hit Max in the foot. Now ahead, Sam again. Or Zach, excuse me. Oh, what I was thinking. Sam. I think Sam O'Reilly. I don't know, two tall guys. Now, and I guess it went out or something. Can't possibly have been offside on OA. Maybe it was offside on the Eagles. That one goes low, past a few players. On tap to head, can Carney keep it in? He can. There's Joey Carney, cut it to the inside. Past a few players, Alex went down. He's slow to get up. Well, he does get up eventually. And it is a corner kick, his athletic director, Dr. Uh, Mr. Mike McCaffrey down in the corner. He's still wearing shorts, even though it's around 45 degrees outside. That is impressive. I, I can't do that. I'd, I'd freeze to death. But um, out. Ah, had a good juggle by the referee. <laughs> Just trying to do something. I don't know. I'm Just trying to keep the ball. At least within reach was the referee. Don't blame him. Alon. Vlad got a sliver of a foot on it. And Luke heads down and Diego touches it down. As Diego cut through a couple defenders. Now sent it ahead, James is flying and is on side. James Jennings. Cut it back, off to the middle for Vlad. Vlad keeps it. Here's Diego with a touch. Goes back for Vlad. Diego goes down! And it's a penalty! OA pleading their case. It was the near side referee that made the call. They'll have a conversation. Diego went down. There was a bunch of players in that little mess right around the top of the box. And it's a penalty. No, free kick. It's looking like, or is it a penalty? Yes. So it's a free kick for the Eagles. I don't know quite what's going on here. Uh, yeah, it is a free kick. So. I assume that was part of the discussion there is where was the call, or where was the, the foul? And the foul occurred just outside the box. So now a really good chance for the Eagles to get back in it. It's Diego Martinez on the kick. Drew Hall has the wall set up to Diego's left, Hall's right. And Hall, Manning, his left side, Diego's right. This is a tough chance. And a good setup by Hall with six guys in the wall. Yeah. Diego, just wide. Oh, he completely threw off everybody. Went under the wall and froze. 
Drew Hall. And if that had been on target, that would have been in. Because Hall just froze. He didn't know what to do. The referee's unhappy with that quick goal kick. Not all the OA players were completely off the field. It's Hall and the kick. Leo almost fanned on it. Sent ahead, Carney. It's onside. Leo plays it out. Tried to play it out off of him. Couldn't do it. They just have to do that when they're on one leg. It's like trying to hit a wiffle ball off of a, uh, a flamingo. So the throw comes in. It's flicked along now. Away shouting for a penalty. I feel like that one was definitely closer than the Eagles' chance just a few minutes ago. Here's Diego. Up ahead, Vlad with a head of steam. I assume that's like a steam train reference. It's just right up my alley. Owen, couldn't dart back. And that one did go off of an OA player. So an eagle throw. Vlad looking all the way ahead. That's still in the box! And James, don't blame him for the effort. It's just a little heavy on the chance. And now the referee is coming over to talk to someone. It's Owen. I don't know what that conversation is. I'm not even going to try to make a guess or anything. That's, that's it. Now that's where I get yelled at. James getting yelled at by Alon, saying, come on. Carney completely missed. Luke might not have been looking for Diego, just managed to do that. Now Vlad got it to Owen. Over Zach Bernstein's head. And he got grabbed and twisted around. Like someone might grab you in like a 50s dance scene, or something like that. Like grab, and then you do the twirl, and then, then, and then. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. So it's a lawn with four guys in the box, plus James circulating around the top of the box. A lawn will shoot it just over the bar. Why not? Let fly a lawn. Especially with. Him only having two games left in his high school career. At least two soccer games. I don't know if he plays any other sports. I don't think he does. The kick comes long. Now tapped ahead. Break on for away. Cut inside, they got the cross off and a can of corn for Sam O'Reilly. Vlad, Alex. Oh, Vlad hit an OA player, didn't mean to. Back for Joey Carney. Oh, gone to the head. Luke will power it out. Couple subs waiting to come in. It's looking like someone in 
Josh Cabral. So that's a very good ball on that near sideline OA attacking. And crossed and got by everyone and rolls its way out. It's Vlad and Alex out. That's Carlos Aguilar, the other guy in. In for Alex. Well, Diego tried a cheeky flick header. Did not work. Now ahead, Carney is on side. Everyone's shouting for a handball. Well, I mean, all the OA players. Now picked off by Max, and now he's flying forward. Played out. By away. Well, one more game for the Eagles this season. And I think one more game for everyone this season. Josh. Foul whistle as a lawn went down. Final game is against Stoughton. That's on Thursday at 6. So the Eagles and the Black Knights join us for that one. Here at, from the stadium. Now it's headed along. Kept in by Owen. Cut it inside twice. Floats it past everyone. James waited too long. And OA trying to fly forward. James, it stays in. And that's out. Off OA. And got past Carlos and headed along and now a break. Or not. As Luke gets in the way. Foul called on a lawn there. The temperature starting to heat up between these two longtime bitter rivals. Many a games have been played in both Sharon and Easton where things have gotten a little feisty, shall I say. See what happens in the remaining 21-ish minutes. This one is that one's crossed in. It's a corner. On what appears to be the coldest night of October, which is good means Thursday's not going to be cold. And the wind's starting to pick up, which I assume is part of the cold. Well, I'm cold. It's crossed in. Sam punched it out, and it's on the line. And it's in. It's a goal, I think. Nope. Foul. Foul on the goal line. Don't see that too often. Calling the high boot on Diego. <laughs> Every sec. <laughs> hey, that one's on you. That's a good one. <laughs> uh. Parents asking. Just gotta. I am the messenger. Sounds crossed in. That was a odd scissor kick, and then the shot goes flying off into the night, and is gonna bounce out towards Beach Street. Which, in fairness, is a really hard thing to do, but just off balance, and the shot went all floopy. So, you know. Twenty minutes to play. Here from the stadium. Josh got taken down. Alon to take the kick, the Eagles pushing forward. 
Three is a recoverable lead. Or a, a recoverable deficit, I should say. A couple of moves there from Leo. Josh trying to win it back, and then a shoulder on shoulder collision, and they'll call that on Owen. Well, that looked like a bit of a 50 50 ball. Obviously, Owen leaning in. They could do some. They would definitely get some brownie points with Milan Lucic on some of those hits. But in fairness, I don't know why Luch should be watching, you know, random high school soccer from Southeast New England, or Southeast Massachusetts. That's possible, I don't know, just flipping through Google, this pops up and be like, ah. Zach Bernstein only able to push the ball out farther. I guess is what he did. That was the cord. Crossing possibility. Max called off Sam. Oh, they'll get it ahead. Foul whistled as Diego was taken down. At this point, I'm now only recognizing Diego given the uh, the knee brace after what happened on Saturday. Seventeen and change to go here from the stadium. No major stoppages in play. Leo foul whistled. Maybe a throw, or probably a foul. There was much grabbing and pushing and shoving and other stuff about on that far side, and it is a free kick. Six in the box for the Eagles. Sounds crossed in, Hall goes down. Makes the play. And that is a very, very good catch from Drew Hall. It's a very tough play to make. And he boots it 70 yards. That one picked off, break Eagles. Oh, James. Way underestimated the weight of that pass. And now it tapped in his face, and that should be a yellow on Carlos. And it is. And that. They're free. Having words with Carlos shows him the yellow. So. Stopping a promising attack. Called on Carlos. And I think that is the right call there. From the near side official. Well, it kind of felt like it was coming for the Eagles. But the heat of this game has definitely picked up quite a bit. And a free kick coming. They get it in. Sam with the easy catch and got shoved. And punts it long. Carlos waiting to come back in the game. Well, that's a good pass with the outside of the foot. Now Luke off Leo.
Leo. Got that one to Josh. And an OA player in the side of the shoulder. And then got that one ahead for Owen. Elon. Off a pair of defenders. Now tapped ahead. Luke with a touch. Diego tried to chip it. Owen with a good header. And then that one shot back is going to bounce over the uh, storage thingy. That's a great description. Yeah. Yeah. Storage thingy. Storage box? Oh. Well, the Eagles bring in their bench. Eventually, the next stoppage is Diego fired it way past everything. And now the Eagles will bring in their bench for changes. Leo, Zach, James, and... And Owen out. Zach Connors, Aiden, Peter, and Koya. The four that came in for the Eagles. Rough tackle from Peter. Uh, sent ahead. Luke played it off of the OA player who then promptly slipped. Elon is going to win the ball after several players completely missed. Sent ahead. Oh, crap. Forgot to restart the clock. I apologize for that. Oh crap, forgot to set it. All right. Now it's sent into the box, picked off and sent over. And the foul was called. I so apologize, I was working on the clock there. No way a player went down to the box. Not his box, but a box. Foul was whistled. The kick comes low, past a few players. Aiden looking for it. Here's the lawn. Foul whistled, Alon. Getting the benefit of the doubt there. Well, 12 minutes and change to play here at the stadium. Down, shot in. Cleared out to pass Luke. Away oh, player tripped and fell, looked like. Here's Carlos. Zach Connors. So he's the only Zach in the game right now, so. That one tapped out by Max. And a goalie switch. And that's it for Drew Hall. Drew Hall, a spectacular performance here this evening as that one's headed out and it's a corner into the shot put ring. I think it was shot put circle in the previous games. So the far side referee doing some 
Woodworking. He's got his his hammer. Phillips head, screwdriver, and everything. He's got even got the little uh, belt. That was crossed in and they put it in. What an unbelievable goal. That's an Olympico from the corner. How about that? That is one of the hardest goals to score in the game of soccer. And we've just witnessed it. And a nice little team picture. That was insanely impressive as Ethan Borges is coming on for Sam O'Reilly. Sam's got to realize that. Yeah, there you go. Well, Sam just got victimized on a couple of those chances. But overall, pretty good. Made a couple of good saves. And so, with everyone playing their secondary goalies, Josh slips, nothing happened. Just he did not slip, nothing happened. You saw nothing. Diego, powering past a few defenders, now ahead. Aiden's in! Oh, he just ran through the goalie! <laughs> Aiden nearly getting the Eagles back into this one. Nearly ran through the OA goalie who slipped. That nearly ended very poorly for everyone. That one's out. On sent to the far side. It's like a bad bounce. Koya back for Peter. Up ahead, Diego can't keep it in. Throw comes in, headed up. Luke with a collision in midair. Diego with a nice chip play. Just now the Eagles, two freshmen on the varsity squad, both on the field. Ethan and uh, Ethan and Netton. Josh is a, uh, an attacking midfield. Mid, mid. All right, never mind. Words are too difficult. There he is, Josh. Now picked off, the lawn has it. And that was a foul. Now sent into space, Ethan does not come off his line. It's cleared. Carlos can't keep it in. The OA parents unhappy with the, the lawn challenge a few moments ago. It was late and it was a bad challenge, but. Now sent ahead. Luke got ahead on it. Here's Alon. Josh goes back to Alon. Diego. Now in sent way, way ahead. Here's Alon. Referee plays advantage. And now an eagle throw. Luke will send that one up, 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 up in the air. Well, four nothing away. The Tigers, as it stands, sweeping the season series two to zero with an aggregate score of nine nil across the two games. As so the throw comes in, Luke got a head on it, and another player got a head on it. Third player got a head on uh, the second. That was Luke.
Trying to get the cross in, Luke. And I'll keep it in for a moment. Then it's sent out. Aiden might have misjudged where that one was going. And Luke will blast that one out 50 yards. Josh touches it down. Alon picked off, cut across. Ethan coming off his line, it's off the bar. Oh, inches away from a fifth. Or away. Well, Ethan slipped coming off of his line. Might have gone a little late, but just unlucky there for OA. There's now Diego cutting inside and out and inside again. Now tapped ahead, that would have been offside. They'll lay it off. Crossed in, Ethan goes up, makes the grab. And we'll punt that one. Well, you'd figure that once Sam heads off to college in a year and a half, uh, Ethan would be the starting goalie in his junior and senior year. My junior and senior year, too. He's in my grade. Forgot to stop the clock. <laughs> There we go, five minutes. Now it's set the cross off ahead. Almost fell perfectly for Diego, or not Diego, Aiden. Well, not one, not two, but six subs waiting to come in for away as Luke went down and here comes the sub and the battalion switch. As literally more than half of OA's on-field squad is getting subbed off and they are almost literally putting their entire bench in. Like I think the only two guys left on the bench are maybe one more player and Drew Hall, who at this point, I don't know if he can get subbed back in. I feel like the only way that they could do that is there's an injury. Now it's cut across. Past six defenders and the shot was blocked. Cut across, there's a shot! Just over the net. And Ethan having to sprint back to get the ball. But a really good chance for a way to add it on. Ethan's goal kick. Comes out Diego with a nice header. Aiden wins it back. It's Aiden Garcia. Got it across, up ahead. Diego will touch it. Josh. Oh, couldn't work it past the defenders. Carlos. Touches it ahead, couldn't get it past a couple defenders. Runs out and away throw. A knocked ahead, fed forward, that one's gonna roll out. No, I'm sorry, it stays in. It's good hustle. And cut back to the inside and Max tripped him. Oh. 
The three in the box for OA. No, shoot it! And Ethan realized that he was shooting a little late, but made the save anyway. And now he punts it out, and it's going to land out of bounds. Well, it landed in bounds and bounced out. Zach Connors. Here's Peter Lerner dashing back. Nice touches there by Koya. Koya still going. Josh. Elon. Up ahead. Diego let it go. Peter takes the throw. Yeah, that rhymes. Diego. And played out as far as Koya. Peter gets the ball in. Easily scooped by the goalie. Referees will check their watches. It's punted out. There's still more time. Apparently. Unkicked way up in the air. Elon. Carlos. Tried to get it ahead. It wasn't enough. And that will do it. OA sweeps the season series 2-0. Aggregate score 9-0. And in this one, it's a 4-0 victory for the visiting Tigers. A couple of fantastic goals in the penalty goal, as well as the Olympico here in the second half. Finish off a well-played OA game. And for the Eagles, it's the last game of the season this Thursday night here from the stadium. So join us for that, whether it be watching it or here at the stadium. And we'll see you then as the Eagles take on the Stoughton Black Knights in the last game of the 2023-24 season. So for all of our crew, three cameras. I think that's Cam on the field, Warren and Ryan upstairs, and Isaac Garofsky, our director, who is getting you all those cool shots and whatnot in the studio, or in the press box. I'm Nick Weider saying so long and good night from Sharon High School Stadium. Your final here this evening is the Oliver Ames Tigers 4 and the Sharon Eagles 0. No.